Welcome back, everyone. Today, we will be making beef stroganoff. If you like our videos, please subscribe. These are the things that you will need. You will need two to three pounds of ground beef. You will also need one third cup of red wine, two tablespoons of corn starch, one half cup of sour cream. You will also need one half cup of mushrooms, one whole onion, two cups of beef stock and one cup of heavy cream, one tablespoon of minced garlic, five tablespoons of butter, two tablespoons of parsley, one tablespoon of smoked paprika, one tablespoon of black pepper, one teaspoon of thyme, one teaspoon of oregano, and one half teaspoon of salt. These are the things you need for the beef stroganoff. All right, everyone, it's time to get started. I am using a fettuccine noodle. Uh, I just cut them in half, and this is what I'm going to use, but you can use any type of pasta that you like. Wash and chop all your vegetables up, and then after you chop all your vegetables up, go ahead and take your cornstarch, and you want to mix it in your beef stock or your beef broth. Go ahead and mix that in. And then we're going to save our red wine. We're going to take our soy sauce. Go ahead and add that to the beef broth. Now put your onions in your pan. And then also add the minced garlic. And what we're going to do is we're going to saute this to get it to be like a translucent. Saute it a little bit. Now we're going to add some uh, butter and some of our spices. Save the parsley for last. Go ahead and put all your spices in, but don't put the parsley in right now. Save that. Now go ahead and put your meat in. Make sure you uh, break it down really, really good. Brown your meat. Go ahead and fry or brown your meat. Now add your mushrooms. We have browned our meat, so we're going to go ahead and start cooking our mushrooms some. This whole process takes about 10 minutes. Once you get everything set up, it takes about 10 minutes. You know, go ahead and uh, cook the mushrooms in with your meat to get it all broken down so everything will be very good. Now take the rest of your butter and your parsley, go ahead and put that in and mix that all together. Break that all down, mix it up real good. Get everything distributed and incorporated. This is gonna be a wonderful beef stroganoff. Very flavorful. Now take your red wine and go ahead and put it in there and uh, Go ahead and saute that red wine in with your mushrooms and your beef. It makes the sauce really rich and creamy. And it gives it a very good taste. Now, last thing you need to do is go ahead and uh, stir up your beef stock again. Get everything mixed up. Go ahead and add your beef stock in. And this is going to act as your uh, sauce thickening agent. So we're going to cook this down for a good 10 minutes and we're going to come back. Now, 10 minutes has passed. Our beef and broccoli sauce is ready. Mmm, doesn't that look delicious? Now we're going to turn the fire down to low. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to get ready to add our heavy cream. Because we're going to thicken our sauce up a little bit. We haven't added the sour cream. We're just putting in our heavy cream right now. We're going to get that all mixed up and incorporated and let the sauce thicken a little more with our heavy cream. 
Now, take a little bit of the hot sauce and put it in a, a cup. And then you want to temper your uh, sour cream because you don't want it to curdle on you. So go ahead and mix that around. Get it like temper, bring the temperature up a little bit. So when you do put it in, it won't curdle up on you when you uh, put it into your dish. So go ahead and put that in and mix it in real, real well. I'm turning my heat up just a tad bit. But I'm cooking it on medium low. You see, bring it in a little bit closer. You see how it's looking now? I'm bringing the uh, temperature back up and everything is getting all incorporated and mixed together. Doesn't that look delicious? And the only thing, the last thing we have to do is, after we get our sauce good and mixed up, we're going to cover it and let it cook for about two minutes. Now I'm uncovering it and um, letting my sauce thicken up a little bit. I'm going to get ready and add my noodles. See how the sauce is thickening up? While it's thickening up a little bit more, I'm going to go ahead and pair this with some good onion garlic bread. This is a French uh, onion garlic bread. It is delicious with beef stroganoff. Mm, sauce is ready now. We're getting ready to add our noodles or whatever type of pasta you use. Go ahead and put that in and mix it all together. And when you get it all mixed up, we're going to cover it and we're going to let it simmer for about a good two to three minutes. And then when that's done, you have wonderful beef stroganoff. Putting this wonderful onion bread in the oven. And when that get ready, we'll be ready to eat. All right, everybody, dinner is served. This is is a wonderful fantastic meal our beef stroganoff and i will see you guys next time look at our onion bread didn't it come out good very delicious and we're gonna have it tonight with some merlot wine it's delicious And I want to thank you guys for watching. And, and I want to conclude this video with a prayer. Heavenly Father, you are the beginning and the end. Thank you for loving us and blessing us. Thank you for moving across our country. Thank you for being the blessing. And thank you for my Savior, Lord Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name, amen. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe.